The density of the material can be easily calculated if we are given the mass and the volume of a sample. In this example, we're given that a 230 milliliter sample of butter has a mass of 200 grams, and we're asked to calculate the density of butter in grams per centimeter cube, or grams per cubic centimeter. We know that the formula for density is density equals mass divided by volume. We'll make a note of the mass and volume in a table here. The mass of the sample is 200 grams. And because milliliters is a unit of volume, we can state that the volume of the sample is 230 milliliters. However, we notice that they want us to calculate the density in grams per centimeter cubed, or grams per cubic centimeter. So the unit we use for volume needs to be cubic centimeters. It is known that one milliliter is the same as one cubic centimeter. So 230 milliliters is the same as 230 cubic centimeters. And we can now put 230 in for the volume in cubic centimeters. Now we can substitute the values for mass and volume into our equation. Density equals mass divided by volume. We substitute 200 grams in for mass and 230 centimeters cubed for cubic centimeters in for volume. So the density is 200 grams divided by 230 cubic centimeters, which comes out to 0.87 grams per cubic centimeter, or 0.87 grams per centimeter cubed. So the answer to this question is the density of butter is 0.87 grams per cubic centimeter.